Welcome to this Windows channel and another video in our privacy settings in the creators update. What do we have? We have, of course, in the next installment of the privacy updates in the settings, camera. And what does this mean? So, of course, you got an on general on off switch at the top. Let apps use my camera. You know, this is a very delicate situation. A lot of people aren't sure if they want that camera to work. A lot of people to put a little, you know, piece of tape over it or a sticker over the camera because they're scared of the, having the camera turned on without their knowledge. So it, uh, it's up to you. Remember one thing, if you do actually put that switch at off, it does not affect everything. So what that means is that if you put the switch for the camera at off, the, you know, if you get malware, if you have specific software that are Windows desktop 32 apps, they bypass this setting. This is really mostly for what is apps in Windows that you get from the Windows Store. So desktop 32 apps can use your camera even though you put the switches off. And once again, if you have malware that could technically turn off your turn on your webcam, uh, it bypasses this setting. That's important to know. So of course, general switch once again, and then you have all the apps that are using your camera that you can turn on or off. So for example, Twitter, I don't know why TuneIn Radio wants to use a camera, the translator, I don't see why, or maybe because it can take a picture and translate something. So you know, I'll say with off uh, store, no. Skype, yeah. Photos, of course, OneNote, nope. Uh, Microsoft Jigsaw, you know, why does a game want your camera? So, you know, depending on what you're going to do, you might want to turn on or off the different switches of the different apps. But don't, you know, uh, if, if, if you really don't want it, there's a general switch here. Once again, it's important to know that this does not affect desktop 32 apps. So, like I said, if you have a... Um, you know, third-party software that wants to use the camera, or you do get a malware. There's not a lot of them, but if you do get a malware that might, might want to use a camera, that switch doesn't turn off everything. It turns off mainly the apps from Windows itself that come from the store. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you so much for following us on this channel.